Hey dolls, hey y'all. It is Melissa Q. What's up? I hope you guys are having an awesome, amazing Monday. And it's makeup time. It's makeup Monday time. This is the time where I organize my drawer for the whole entire month. It makes getting up, first of all, so easy. And before we get even into the makeup, thanks so much for watching. Let me just say that first. And if you're new, I hope you guys enjoy something else on my channel. You won't get to see my face. So I hope you check out any other, uh, any of my other videos that shows my face. But this is all about organization, decluttering what I have not used, I don't need, I don't like, and going through this drawer and just uh, really chit-chatting with you guys about an everyday makeup drawer. If you don't have a drawer, hey, just get a space of uh, a space that makes getting ready so much easy in the morning. This helps me out so much. Let's get started. Y'all know I have three categories. Either I'm going to keep it, I'm going to declutter it, or I'm going to give it away. If I give it away, that means that I'm either, either giving it to friends or family or it's quality. Um, to the point where I can sell it on the block sale. If I'm going to declutter it, that means that I am scratching it from my collection. And this is a great way to gauge it because if I haven't used it in a month and grabbed for it, then I need to check myself and figure out because I am downsizing my makeup collection. Y'all, I have even deodorant and my brush and stuff. So first of all, let's get some stuff out of here that does not belong. And y'all know that happens all the time. So I'm just going to wane through here. I have panty liners, y'all. TMI. But y'all know this is what happens. Okay, so I have a couple of things that I do want to talk about that I am going to take out of this collection or at my everyday makeup drawer just because it doesn't. Someone um, actually gave me the chance of trying some the ordinary products. And I, to be honest with you, was a bit overwhelmed with the ordinary. So. I'm actually going to give these back to her, but I can tell you from the ones that I have, I'll go ahead and let you know which ones I like. So these are all from The Ordinary. Okay, so let's start with the Hyaluronic Acid. This one is okay. Um, I have, yeah, let's take that light down a bit. These are from The Ordinary. Um, the, the Hyaluronic Acid was okay. Let's see. This is the retinol. This was really good to be as cheap as it was. I think that's like six or seven dollars. Lactic acid was okay. And this is the squalene. This is okay. I thought I had something else in here. I think I do, but we'll go through it because um these these were good. I thought I had something else. Oh, I do. Buffet. Amazing. This is amazing. The Buffet. And I have this glycolic toner, which I probably should try tonight. I haven't even tried this. And um, I just wanted, she was like, hey, um, one of my coworkers is really into uh, the ordinary. And if you didn't know, they're going to Sephora which is awesome because they're inexpensive but let's get into this i even have a stapler okay let's get into organizing in here okay so the first thing is this toothbrush i use for my hair from slicking down them edges okay i have band-aids in here for my son okay so beauty blenders and brushes need to come out because i need to clean them Okay, this is the MAC Prep and Prime Natural Radiance Visage. I love this. This is old school MAC, and I am actually using this. I think this is in a project pan, but I really do like this. I still feel like I have a good amount of this to use up. So this is going to go right back in here. I'm actually going to take this out because I'm going to put this in a project pan that's going to come up in the new year. And that is um, Finish 19 by Spring and or 18 by Spring. Say Finish 18 by Spring, 19 by Spring. 
one of those but it's a 2018 project pan so I am going to take that out because currently the moisturizer that I'm using is the Mary Kay and I'm almost done with this so um that I'm going to organize and put that back in these are some lip glosses for the holidays I've talked about this in a favorites video I don't think I've shown you guys these um but they're going to stay in here and these are the makeup forever metallic artist glosses super pigmented i talked about them in my favorites if you want to check that out i will link it over here in the i cards so um yeah these are really good those are gonna stay in here these are from the brand called minted they are cruelty free and vegan and they are amazing for women of color they these are shades those are the type of nudes that um really flatter us and or anybody for that matter is just is very complimentary this is something that's specifically you know for us that works i have some nail polishes over here and speaking of that i actually need to do my nails so let's go through some things i have not used this yet and this is the oh for wonder lush by Kim Ty. I did well I did use this I like this it's just that I feel like when things are already open that I should use that first and so uh will I leave this in no I'm gonna take that out I want to finish up this powder this is the makeup fat not makeup forever this is the Mary Kay powder and you can see how much let's see you can see how much I have in that that is what is left so I'm actually going to put this back in. I have not talked about this, but y'all, I love this. This is by Mally Beauty. This is such an underrated product. And I don't even know what she calls this. The Evercolor Poreless Face Defender Boost. Really nice product. I'm going to keep that in because that's great for cream contouring and highlighting. Uh, the Laura Geller, this is in the shade this is a tan powder i really like this but it's really dark at the moment and i kind of think that i want to give it to one of my sisters so i'm gonna declutter that this is the tom ford eyeshadow palette in zero four honeymoon you'll see a review count going up on this one because it is such a beautiful palette I'm actually going to keep this in here. This is great in conjunction to the Lorac Pro. So I'm going to keep that in here. This is a face powder. Like a beauty powder. It has a beautiful peach sheen. It's very, very light too. But I'm going to keep that in here. I think. I'm going to put some nail polishes in here. In this slot. These are ones that I actually want to use this month. Some of these are nudes. If you know anything about me. I love nudes. What is this? This is Laura Mercier in the shade Milky Way. That's pretty. I'll keep that in. I actually need to throw that in my purse. Fresh lip balm. I'm going to keep this in here. As a matter of fact, I'm going to keep it on my top shelf. That way I can use it before I go to bed. I actually like that. I need these. Don't need to be in there. This is a great for sculpting my brows, I guess. Do I want to keep this? Yes. I like how stiff the consistency of these creams are. Yeah, sorry for my arm being crossed, y'all. I've been really loving these highlighters by My Little Pony. I have not been able to put these down, but I feel like I need to use something else. Um, I'm going to keep that one in there. I have used this one a lot. And it's such a pretty frost. I don't know. I've been getting a lot of the use of these. So we'll take these out. Okay. I have not used the Fiona Styles bronzer. I feel like I need to use something else before I use this. I don't know. This is so cute for my, it's such a like nice tone. I'm not going to use this because I really want to get use out of my, I've hit pan in this. I think I talked about this in my last update. 
but I did hit pan if you can see right there and I'm about I think I'm going to hit pan in this one next so because these are bronzers that I actually want to pan this palette that's going to be going back in as well as the Rock Pro I'm going to take this out um, that is the shade Wisp such a pretty uh, oh that's pretty okay I'm gonna keep that one in here okay I am actually gonna put this in the block sale this is another Smashbox photo finish I'm gonna put that in the block sale so I'm gonna take that out this is an eye powder this is Sasha buttercup I think um, highlighter like the under eye powder I really 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 do like this powder but I'm using these so I'm actually gonna take this out makeup Shayla I want to get some use out of this palette I think that to be honest with you this looks a lot like the shades that's in the Tom Ford and this one right here so do I want to use this um Let's hold off on this because I want to get use out of the Tom Ford and the Lorac Pro. I think this is such a beautiful palette. This is the And God Created the Woman and God Created and God Created the Woman palette by NARS. That is such a beautiful palette. This is actually what I feel like I should have panned first. Like this is six pans instead of trying to pan how many from the Lorac Pro 14 I think so this is such a beautiful palette though um I think I want to keep this one in here okay so y'all know I pan this was the first eyeshadow that I ever panned and it's I love this shade um it's one that you can use by itself this is that cream shade but I am trying to, I want to pan the Lorac Pro one first. So I'm actually going to, these are the same shades that are in that Lorac Pro. So I'm going to take that one out. I want to try this Cosmic Metals palette. Well, I've tried some of these. Y'all, I want to see, can y'all tell I just opened up that Tom Ford. A lot of these shades are kind of comparable to it. So I want to see if this is maybe a dupe. I know Tom Ford versus NYX. Insane, right? So we're going to see. I have not given any love to my Baked Browns palette by Dose of Colors um, this month. I have tried the shades before. I'm going to do a review on it. So I don't want to let you guys know yet just how I feel about it. But... I'm going to take that out. As you can tell, we have some more room in here, but that's okay. Because I think the only thing I want to bring in maybe are highlighters. I am going to keep this quad, I think, in here. Because these are some more warmer shades that I want to get some use from. And this is the NYX Full Throttle Palette in Color Riot. So beautiful orange, a burgundy. I'm loving this shade. So I'm gonna keep this one in. Y'all can see this. I hope I've been in frame this whole time. I'm gonna keep this one in here because I don't have anything in here like that. So what do I need to pull in? I need to pull in a blush or some blushes. Um, I've been loving this, which I think I'm going to keep in. This is the CoverGirl Contour and Highlight. That's a cream contour and highlight. This is a lip palette. I think I want to continue to have this in here. And I've been using this Bite Beauty Agave. I don't even know why I have this still on here. But I've been using this lip mask. I think this is perfect for the winter. So I think this is going to stay in here. Okay. Like I said, I have had these in here. These are so good. It's like once you get hooked on something, you don't want to take these out. The, I think these were supposed to be out from last month. And I used the ColourPop, I think. What 
palettes. I think I want to really concentrate on, I did have this palette, which is the Tardis, Tardis Pro. Such a beautiful palette, but I think I want to concentrate and use the Tom Ford, the Cosmic Metals. Oh, where's my Desi? I want to use my Desi uh, palette. Hey, I'm all about glosses right now, so these glosses, I'm transferring them over. I want to get some more use out of my, this is Marc Jacobs Slow Burn. I'm going to be really selective today. That's Mauve Over. want that. These are mascaras. I'm going to keep these in here because I need to go through those. I'm going to keep in, this is Melted Fig. I'm going to keep that in. I have not gotten any, any use of Tansy yet, but I don't have any colors in here. And this is, um, what is this, Fudged Pretty Lip Gloss. Kind of sticking to the same lip glosses, but keeping this lip conditioner. I told you the Cosmic Metals have been my favorite. That's Makeup Forever, Cosmic Metals. That's a Makeup Forever shade. I'm going to take that out because I really haven't been using that. This is Bare Minerals Lip Gloss. Will I be using that? Not really. Not using this. Taking that out. I think. Let's see. Any other lip colors? This is an eyeliner and a pro... Wait, an eyeshadow stick, a Primo Lash, don't need this, this. Okay, so we're taking out some lip colors. Let me put these back. I'm going to bring in, this is a dose of colors. I have learned that I am absolutely in love with this formulation of liquid lipsticks, so I'm going to keep these in here. I want to finish off this color corrector, but I'm going to keep this up here at the top because I, I feel like I reach for those more. I'm going to declutter. This is the Amazing Cosmetics Illuminate. This is probably going to be in a product disappointment video because that just keeps creasing on me. Um, let me put my moisturizers over here by themselves. Put in this palette, of course. And we're going to put it in the Lorac Pro. Okay. I'm going to put this Wonderlush over here. I'm going to put these on the side just because I'm not going to be using them, but I really don't have a place to store them at the moment. Oh, now let's grab some blushes because of that I don't have. I think I've been using Toasted Almond, but I have it at the bottom. Okay. So this Makeup Forever, I still have to use. This is a Project Pan. This I'm going to leave at the top. That one's kind of like a rosy shade. Oh, here's my Desi. This needs to be in here. Desi and Katie. Okay, I want to get some more use out of this. This is Fervor by NARS. And that's how that looks. And it's like a beautiful like wine shade with a lighter one. I feel like that, that's something that's going to look a uh, Amazing. Let's kick it old school with the highlighter. This is the Mary Luminizer. I think this is one of my first highlighters. Let's kick it old school, y'all. Let's get some use out of this blush trio by Eve Pearl. I decluttered one. I kept this one. I like, I want to try, I want to use this shade right now. Okay. I think we are done, y'all. I think we're done. Let's use the Milani. I've been hearing some things about the Milani eyeshadow primer, so we will use this. And that's it, you guys. We have organized our makeup drawer. It looks so much better than what it was before. I hope you guys enjoyed decluttering. Um, let's do a recap. We've taken out these items, which we're gonna put in our put away in our makeup drawer. We're going to put this, um, let's put our 
makeup wipes in here too because I'll grab those. And I think that is it. Thanks so much, you guys, for watching. And I will see you guys in the next video.